Uh, okay, so um, yeah, this is just going to be the summoning video for uh, Holiday Euphine. As you can see, I have the uh, 600 bookmarks up there. Uh, I'm going to do a couple Moonlight summons as well. Uh, what else? That's it. Um, she looks kind of interesting. Uh, hopefully, I get one of her artifact at least. That's going to suck if I don't. But uh, you know, what can you do? Uh, so. Uh, I'll do this at the end, see how many uh, stones I get. Um, yeah, see how many stones I get, and then see if we can get another uh, third summon out of there. So let's just do it. Oh, actually, hold on. Okay, yeah, uh, sorry about that. I had to go fill out the, uh, the old inventory. Um, but yeah, so... Yeah, okay. Yeah, so... Just get in there, start uh, summoning. That's it. Got her on the first pull. It's over. <laughs> uh, so let's take a look here. Actually, I needed a little bit more, a few more shadow roses. Um, she's pretty good. She's like, she's obviously not that fast, but she's pretty decent in terms of like a, a tanky comp. Like, like, if you take her, maybe like a crown and SSB, uh, she's pretty good. Right, like, she'll move the whole team forward and give you attack buff as well as just helping. Because that team, that, that comp, if you bring it in anything, it's because you expect to tank whatever's coming at you next. Um, so, I think it's pretty good. Uh, originally, there was, she, she was, I think, I think somewhere around the last part. Of the of the last uh, RTA season, people were like using her in RTA. Uh, I thought that was kind of interesting, but uh, not that remarkable. Uh, what do I want in terms of anything? Uh, well, in terms of five star artifacts, I mean, I don't really want any four star artifacts. There's not much more I need, but five star artifacts, I want hers most of all. But if I don't get hers, uh, Alexis baskets are always nice. Uh, mine's not. I don't even have one in there. Um, what else? I mean, Etika's is all right. I don't know if I want to invest enough to like. Like, I don't know if I'd rather take an Etika's or something else. But I mean, I'm using a uh, Spectre, uh, regular Chinibri a lot, and Etika's is is really, it's really good. So there's that. Um, I mean, Albers's always. You can use Albers's. What else? Yeah, there's not a whole lot else. Uh, I have two idols, cheers. Neither of them are maxed, so it's not that big a deal. Carrot. I actually, for those of you I'm recording this on the day that uh, Astronox put out one of his videos for Holiday Euphine. Now, he's been he's been making the videos for a while. Just I remember today because I was watching it. Um, the whole like just burn build that you could make on her. Uh, I think it's pretty good. I think uh, that's kind of what I was thinking. Um, as I was like before summoning, I was just kind of thinking about what to do with her because there's not a whole lot. Like you could make her kind of damage dealer, but for one, that requires way too many stats. So I was thinking maybe more like a high effectiveness, high, um, like high attack build. But mine wasn't running the junkyard dog because I was thinking about using the um, her artifact uh, just for the possible stuns. I think it's the artifact. No? Okay. Uh, Rosa Harganas. Dust. Uh, I didn't have to go to Pity on Arbiter, so I'm probably... I feel like I'm gonna have to go to Pity on, on hers. Could always use more... Uh, what is that? That's Magahara? Tagahels, yeah. You can always use more Tagahels. Uh, I think I have a max tag of hells right now, but like, I'm just lazy to um, imprint or not imprint it. Lazy to to level it up 
basically is what the problem is. Um, yeah, I mean, I have, I have a few. I think they upped how many um, of those like badges you get from regular raid. Because I've been getting a lot. I've actually been like stacking up a lot of these uh, the red charms. For any of you who don't who don't know that, I feel like the little treasure, the little treasure chest is good. You know, for for getting bookmark, uh, what's it called, gold transmit stones, getting uh, galaxy bookmarks. There's a mola in there. There's a there's a, a hundred sky stones. I think it's a hundred. I'm not entirely sure, but there's sky stones in there. So I think out of out of all those things, that one seems to be the most worth it, just because there's a molagora seed in there. Or I don't know if it's a seed, it might be the whole the mole thing, but that doesn't really matter. Um, at first glance, that might look like the way to go. Like that's the best uh, value. But in terms of like, okay, cool. So I get the, please tell me it's the artifact. I, I need at least one, right? Cause then you just max limit break it. <laughs> of course it isn't. Um, okay, well that sucks. We'll just keep going, I guess. Uh, but what was I on about? Yeah, I mean, it seems at first glance that like that's the best value for your uh, whatever queens to, I don't know what those things are called, the little like tickets you get after you beat a boss. Uh, you can use to buy at the, the little in-game in store, in-map store. Uh, and I wouldn't really necessarily disagree with that because that is a lot of value uh, that's possible to get out of that. But in terms of like strengthening your account and boosting up like your power level of your account, artifacts. Uh, yeah, shouldn't come out. Artifacts are probably some of the easiest like ways. Like maxing out your artifact artifacts are going to be one of the easiest ways to uh, boost your account's power level. Uh, of course, like there'll be times where. Um, you know, once you have everything you want maxed, then, you know, by all means, just do whatever. Uh, but right now, I don't have everything I want maxed. I mean, I don't have a, I don't have a maxed out uh, Elbrus. Not that I have any limit breaks. It's, it's maxed right now, but I need limit breaks, right? But I don't have, like, a maxed out uh, Tag of Hells, like I just said. I don't have a maxed out, uh, uh, what's that other one? Uh, the, well, for one, Junkyard Dog, now that I want to run that, too. Um, it's max limit broken, but again, it's not like fully leveled up. I don't have a fully leveled up Tiger Hells. I don't have a fully leveled up, um, uh, what else? A Portrait of the Saviors. That's a good one to level up, right? So I, at least for me, I don't have a, I don't have a maxed out, um, Aiellas. Uh, so at least for me where I am, uh, and for a lot of people, a lot of people are kind of in that similar situation, but they don't really like, they see YouTubers and they're like, oh, that's, you know, just get that one or, or, or just get this one. Cause you know, it seems like the best value. Uh, but then there, you know, you end up like complaining that there's never enough uh, artifact charms. Like, I mean, I hear it all the time. People always complain they don't have enough art artifact charms. But it's just like, if you're if you're needing them, go there and get them. And once you get to a point where you don't need them again, like I said, just, just go for that box because that box is the best if you don't need uh, charms. Um, but I'm in a situation where I do need a lot of charms, so I've been getting that. But yeah, it's just something I had. Uh, I think I brought that up originally just because I feel like. They increased how many of those little like tickets, those tokens you get, which I think is kind of weird. Um, Cause I think I think Hell Raid has them too. Cause now I think you get two per boss, and since there's five bosses in Hell Raid, uh, that means that once a month you can get a piece of gear. Where before it actually was a lot worse than that because well, so before what I'm assuming now, cause before it took me a while to get a piece of gear because I would do like all all the bosses in the month and only get like five. No, the queen gives you one extra so six is this her yeah that's her um okay so this is kind of annoying because i wanted to get her artifact i might have to pull some more very interesting do the japanese because i have the japanese voice back on the japanese people not have any uh, japanese voice actor for her yet um, so she's going to be here for, what, 12, 10 more days. I'm going to see what kind of bookmarks I can get in that time and then try to pull some more. I'll have another video for that. Um, but we didn't get enough, so let's just go drop these two last Moonlight Summons here. Let's see what we get out of here. Okay, here's my, here's the Arbor of Eldred, uh, again. I mean, let's see. Oh, okay, so let's see what do I got. What am I missing? I'm missing General Purgus. Uh, but I'm, I'm probably gonna get General Purgus out of the uh, out of the the refund ticket we're gonna get for ML Zerato. Uh, so let's try this again. Okay, so three star. 
uh, Lorena. Ah, oh, this kind of sucks because now my Lorena's maxed out. Uh, or she, she's been she got maxed out a while ago. So uh, this is the one over max that I don't really need. Uh, well, that's that. Uh, like I said, probably gonna pull some more, so I'm gonna get some more of these, and then we'll summon. I'll have to do hell raid and raid, and and maybe I'll get a. I just need two, right? And so that'll be two more ML summons plus whatever uh, bookmarks I can get for uh, near the end of the week of this banner and try to pull for uh, Yuffie again. Uh, though, for, like personally, uh, right now, right, the way you build Yuffie, like I said, uh, it, it seems like Junkyard Dog is a pretty good way to go on her. Um, and I wouldn't really argue that. I'm probably going to try it out on her. So that's why, like, the, the uh, artifact, it's not the biggest deal that I don't have it, but... 15% chance to stun, yeah. Not the biggest deal that I don't have it, but you always want to have like at least one copy of the artifact. Um, but uh, yeah, we'll, I mean, we'll see. Near the end of this time frame, um, probably the end of this, we'll probably have news of what's coming next. And I mean, it's usually just going to be uh, like filler stuff after this, but uh, who knows. So yeah, got one decently early, um, about halfway through. It's not that bad. I could probably make this up and make these uh, bookmarks back up within the week. So we'll probably be back here. Um, the reason, so you you can keep pulling on this, but personally, I feel like if you're going to keep pulling, you should pull until you get another Yuffie. So if you get her early, if you pull some more, you get her early, then I'm just going to cut out then. So if I get a second Yuffie before I get the artifact, I'm just out. And I'm like, I'm just going to drop the artifact. Um, it does look very strong. Um, looks like somebody's going to come out and do it. But like, it gives you less chance when you max it than... Dizzy's S1 already has on it, right? And Dizzy's just, all, you know, all around a lot stronger, I feel. Uh, on top of that, um, Abyssal Crown on Dizzy boosts you up to, what, like, 49%? Uh, so in terms of that, I think, you know, Dizzy is already, like... It, it, it's encroaching on what Dizzy already does, is what my, my point is there. Um, which isn't wholly, wholly useful. So I'm going to... You know, if I don't get it, that's fine. Uh, but I'm I do want one, so I'm gonna try to go up to 600 bookmarks again. Um, if I pull another pull another, if you can go all the way to pity, and if I go to pity, I'm not gonna you know pull after that. Um, but yeah, so you know, I might summon a little sooner, might summon a little later, who knows? Um, but yeah, so um, I guess you know, good luck on everybody else summoning. Hopefully, you don't get uh, you don't get jobbed. Let's see what, what was I gonna do? Yeah, I guess that was it.